All right, let's continue. We finished the firing range, so now all is age. <laughs> Why? <laughs> What's about that? Underage or something on the World War Two? It's Ollie, right? Yes, sir. Ollie, how old are you? Fourteen. I'm twenty-three. Bullshit. <laughs> I'm nineteen. Okay, well, that's better. I'm 16. Oh, damn! <laughs> I have every right to be here. More than you, that's for sure. The Nazis didn't bomb Abilene, Texas. They bombed London, England. They destroyed my home. They burned my entire life to the ground, and now I want to do the same thing to the Third Reich. Oh, damn. Go ahead, turn me in. I'll find a way to get to the front. How do you think I got to Tunisia? Forging transfer orders has become an hobby of mine. I will make it to France. France. <laughs> ah, don't worry, Ali. Your secret's safe. I'm pretty sure the lieutenant isn't going to say anything. I can speak. <laughs> Thank you, lieutenant. But I have two rules. Keep your head down and do exactly what I say. Yes, sir. You don't listen to me even once. I'll turn you over to the Germans myself. Understand? I understand, sir. I won't disappoint you. Either of you. Somehow this motley crew has been tasked with saving civilization. <laughs> God help us all. Looking at the graphics up close, it's crazy the amount of detail. Like the wrinkles and stuff. Holy fuck, is this graphics better than Asgard ref? <laughs> Hello? All right. <laughs> talking, training and tests. It's time to go after the Nazis. We're sending you into occupied France. Yes, sir. Your first mission is to make contact with the French resistance. We're okay. working with a cell led by Manon Batiste, who's been our eyes and ears on the ground since the war started. Batiste. Your rendezvous will be along the coast, at the St. Catherine Lighthouse, the Germans are using as an observation post. Okay. The resistance will give you a signal when it's safe to come ashore. You'll have three days to assist the resistance, gather intelligence on German activity, and sabotage targets of opportunity. Now, I'm what? talking about a small communications relay or a fuel truck, not anything like blowing up a train or destroying the Stapo headquarters. This is your first OSS mission. Baby steps. Now I want to introduce you to Huxley, our quartermaster. She'll get you set up with what you need. She'll give you some nice Hi. for the resistance. Three days in and out. Keep it simple. I'll see you on the other side. Dismissed. Um <laughs> do I move? <laughs> Fucking load this Chris. <laughs> Hello, I'm Huxley, your quartermaster. I'm here to brief you on weapons, gear, and all <gasps> the threats you will Yay! Face. Oh, I'm backed up by a full model shop, a sewing brigade, and the best gunsmiths the allied nations have to offer. To answer any <gasps> question. What the fuck? Uh... Okay, guns! <laughs> wow. It has a slower firing rate than the American M1A1, but in the right hands, owned from Colonel Ebbets. <gasps> Apparently it's a family heirloom. He calls it Uncle Nate's Rough Rider. I call it an exploding <laughs> Nazi killing machine. It can be fired oh, bitch. Oh, shit. It's knife. I think I can throw them, right? We have at close range. <laughs> the what the? There's also an intense kickback when firing quickly one-handed. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Jesus, those weapons are pretty epic. <laughs> I love this uh, kind of weapon, like this is my one of my favorite kind of types of shotgun. It's kind of like a short barreled shotgun. I don't know what's called, but I love those. Holy shit! <laughs> what's this? Up. <laughs> Zoom! <laughs> A knife is always lethal when <laughs> well, shit. At enemies. Okay, have a grenade <laughs> and shotguns. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's start the campaign finally. 
Oh, big. This is legit. <laughs> Keep an eye on the lighthouse. We're supposed to look for a signal. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Works for me. I guess. <laughs> that explosion got the attention of all the German patrols in the area. This place is about to be crawling with Nazis. Lieutenant, we need you to eliminate all incoming enemies while Ali and I help Mano with the supplies. Yes. Load up on ammunition and first aid. The Germans will be there any second. Hell yeah, finally playing something. Lieutenant, looks like enemy reinforcements are heading up the road. Be ready. What, what that? Hi. Now! Oh shit! <laughs> There's a lot of them there. Shit! Take this! <laughs> oh shit, I have this! Mm. 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 Jesus. <laughs> Chaos. No. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Panzer Faust. Oh shit. <laughs> Take this. <laughs> Oh. Excellent work, Lieutenant. Always keep your eye out for code books and reconnaissance photos. Every bit of information will help us win the war. And who knows, you might be able to liberate some music for your record collection. Stand by, Lieutenant. We're heading your way. <laughs> and it's on to Doobie's on. Ah, okay, so it's like that. So there are kind of like short sections of missions. This is our base of operations. The village of De Bisson. De Bisson. Most people here are good, but we must operate in the shadows. You never know where the Gestapo has eyes. How bad have things gotten? The German occupation has turned every neighbor into a possible enemy. That's terrible. I will do anything to get the Nazis out of my country. The Third Reich is ruthless. But so is the French Resistance. I grew up here. My old school teacher still lives in that house. <laughs> My grandpère was the village tailor. My parents owned the bicycle shop. That's the boucherie. Oh wow. Where my brother worked. Belle de Coin. And here we are. Our secret base. <laughs> In the library? Okay. Interesting. Hi. <laughs> Welcome to my bookstore. Marcel has a special workshop upstairs. For things you know. But the boom. <laughs> We have a serious problem. Something big is happening inside Gestapo headquarters, and we don't know what it is. Against my wishes, Juliette works inside, undercover as a clerk. She's seen a dramatic increase in radio transmissions and coded messages. What's it all about? They have something, I don't know what, locked away on the second floor. I can't get near it. They've even brought in the Waffen SS. We hmm. need to find out. But our usual source of information has suddenly gone quiet. He knows what's going on. Is he a high-ranking German? Worse. He's French. 
a collaborator. Ah, oh, them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> His name is Louis Metz. He used to be mayor of this town, but he has now betrayed everything and everyone. But if he's a Nazi collaborator, why does he help you? Because we have photographs. Whatever propels Louis to betray his nation also propels him to drink. And um, other excesses. This man is depravity incarnate. Hey! Give me this photos! He will do anything to save <laughs> I wanna see! But something has him spooked bad enough that he will have contact with us. I them it. <laughs> and we're going to go after him. So we're gonna kill him? No. Kidnap. Sure, whatever floats your boat. Lieutenant, this is a perfect spot for our ambush. But we need you to clear out the checkpoint first. I didn't need the checkpoint guards. Well, that's easy. <laughs> Holy shit, those graphics. I'm gonna be like amazed. Every once in a while when I look at it, it's like actual real life there in the distance. It's kind of crazy. Oh shit. God damn it. What the hell? <laughs> Eat this. This rifle is OP. What are those little sequences? What was going on in those pictures? I'll explain it when you're older. <gasps> Sex? <laughs> Parle Francais, madame. Louis and his convoy will pass through here in a few minutes. He travels with an entourage of well trained troops. So we need to be careful. What are you thinking? We set a trap. Some dynamite along the road. Boom. <laughs> Some spigot guns in strategic spots. And our people positioned along the road. Okay. We have to be precise. We need to neutralize everyone but Louis. No witnesses. Lieutenant. Let's put a plan together. Where do you want the dynamite? Uh, give me this. Uh, point. Uh, so the convoy is gonna come here, right? I guess, like on the river here, right? Uh huh. Yeah. Excellent. Like choice. on the bridge. Boom. That's ideal. And now our people. <laughs> Off he goes. So Oli will be... I guess here is a good idea. <laughs> Tactics! Careful. Juliette can snipe here. Sergeant, <laughs> uh, he's gonna be up close here. You're gonna come with me. And we're gonna go... Actually, I don't know. Let, no. Just go from behind there. I'll be on the front. The convoy will be here soon. You can see everything from up there. Okay. Bonne chance. Good luck. <laughs> Let me move. <laughs> Here we go. Ah, so I have like an out spot to look. Will they detonate or? I think we got them. Oh! Shit, a lot of them! Nice! Perfect! He's drunk. Salou, espèce de con, t'as de merde! Ordure! Chien de collabo! 
uh, English, please? Yeah, hey, I understand. Like missing some interesting discourse here. Not for it is verbose. <laughs> it's been two weeks. They know there is a spy. Be careful. You poor baby. What are the Nazis up to? Uh, winning the war? Fist of pute. Uh, fist of pute. I feel impatience right now, Louis. If you think that I'm treating you bad, imagine when we tell the Gestapo all about your nocturnal activities. Remember, oh. I have pictures. <laughs> well, show me them. <laughs> there is a list. A list? Of all the resistance members in Normandy. The Gestapo's been compiling it for months. They are bringing in a trainload of special troops to round everyone up. When? I do not know. I am not privy to... <laughs> Tonight! Five o'clock. Uh, in Normandy, five o'clock? Marcel. A long way. We need to blow up a train. Oh. <laughs> <Alain -Z. laughs> okay. 